got a story to start off with this week something a little bit different so it's sunday evening and we had another rainstorm come through today just like we always do make a long story short i was planning on editing some video today which i got a lot accomplished and i got a text from a farmer and he said that he was out yesterday walking around and stepped in a groundhog hole about broke his leg now it's getting serious so as i'm talking to him about y'all need to come over there today i said i'm just going to head on over there and see if i can't get something done and he said yeah he's got a forklift that he uses inside of his barn <laughs> it's all gravel where he's using it at but there's a certain spot that he has to go through and the groundhog holes there so he about got this forklift hung up in this groundhog hole so bless his heart i'm gonna get over and see if i can't put a groundhog down this evening That's awesome. I haven't been sitting here 10 freaking minutes. 10 minutes. I just walked through the barn right there, showed you guys those holes. I was sneaking in, I seen a lot of sign. Boom. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna sit still and see if another one will come out before I go pick this one up. Stand by. do something a little bit different in this video what I was really wanting to do was just sit here a little bit longer I hadn't been sitting here 10 minutes and see if another groundhog came out of this barn you guys see me walking through there there's five holes next to one another I'm only assuming that one hole is entry one hole is exit another groundhog belongs to the other two holes and then the one in the middle I can only assume that it that it might adjoin the two tunnels I'm not sure Anyways, I'm going to go meet up with Tommy Lee. He's at a spot that's got, he says, like 20 holes in a barn. And landowners wanting them gone. So I'm going to go retrieve this groundhog and meet up with him. See what he's got going on. See if we can't put one down over there. Okay, guys, I'm going to retrieve this groundhog. I wanted to share what I was talking about just a second ago. You saw me go through here and point out all these holes. Now I'm going to go down here where this groundhog is laying at. And I want to see if there's another hole there that I missed. Because that's where he popped out of. I just walked through this barn less than five minutes ago. I went over there and set the camera up. Got the gun posted up. And then he popped up. So I put him down. Now I want to show you something interesting about this one hole here. Look at this. So this sucker has got a 
food stocked up right at the entry door so he can literally crawl up to the edge get something to eat and not break his cover freaking smart man smart but this one I'm going over here to pick up not so smart don't ever give me a shot because you ain't gonna like it all right nice one yep let me uh, flip the camera around here and I'll pick him up so here's another hole really active through here there's the hog I can slide over here. Aha, look at here. I should have took this gun off my back. I'm gonna squat down here and show you guys. Here he is. Looky here what I missed. So this is a little compartment room inside this barn. I didn't even know anything about this right here. There were just so many other holes. There he is. I gave him a pile driver to the noodle. About a mid-size one, I think. So, yep, noodle shot. And keeping it clean, once again, let me get where that light isn't shining back on me. Look at this, I don't know, he's a beast. Man, I put it right in his ear. In one side, out the other. Go meet up with Tommy. Hopefully put another one down. And we'll see you guys in a few minutes. Boom. Well, guys, another self-filmed hunt in the books. Really need to hire me a camera guy. <laughs> We're going to chalk another one up to the old Savage Accu Trigger. Farmer's happy. I already contacted him, sent him a message. And, boy, he's just tickled pink. So, good deal. Hey, be sure and check us out on Facebook at Predator Reapers. I'll put the words right here. And also, we have an Instagram account. I'd like for you guys to follow us on. Just put that right there, too. So, you guys, be sure and check us out. We're hunting groundhogs and coyotes. we got turkeys on the forecast. I cannot wait. They're in full strut right now. Our season comes in late every year. It makes it tough, but it is what it is. We're going to get out there and chase them. Just thank God for another day, another opportunity to get out and enjoy this beautiful weather. Everything worked out good. And this beast is going to somebody's dinner table right down the road here. I'll take him down there and let him skin her out and be some good eating for him. So, till next time guys, I'll see you later. Boom.